Hello viewers, I'm SB and welcome back to Headlander. Uh, today, we're going to the moon. Equipment check done. Wait, no not you. I wanted to, I guess, just to operate this thing? Okay, here we go. I wanted to take my fancy body with me, but I guess uh, no sale. Well, I guess at least we're bringing an army to the obvious trap. Although, given the obviousness of this trap, I think they might be prepared for this eventuality. Okay, this moon base looks at least as cool as the one from uh, Wolfenstein. Well, that could have gone better. Looks like that old Zapper Scatter shot everyone. Alright. Who needs to bring your own Listen, body? I've been digging through that old archive data. I found something about a team creating a fancy artificial intelligence using some sort of mind to transfer. It was called Project Methuselah. Lots of folks involved. But there's one in particular that might be you. Last name, Winters. I thought y'all should know that. Oh man, does it turn out that this has been my life's work all along? I have no idea. Also, in case you didn't notice, there is a green Electrolux thing there. So if we can find an Electrolux with green privileges, we should come back here and get free stuff. Alright, nothing of particular interest over here. No hidden hatches or anything. Okay, I am I am doing that thing you said. I have no idea where I'm going. Horizons, an exciting huh. opportunity for citizens to expand their outlook. Citizens will be excited wow. to participate in a series of rewarding and challenging events. Enthusiastic participation is mandatory. Self-evaluation forms will be issued after the current observation cycle. I was kind of hoping that uh, I'd be able to do something cool with all these arms, but uh, it doesn't seem to be the case. Y'all ask me. It feels like Methuselah's looking for something. Boy, that's quite a quite an intuitive leap for you to make there, Mr. Robot. Also, hold on a second. We are at. Uh, we are at seven. Yeah. Okay, so press three to create an impenetrable shield while actually in a body. So that's that's a good thing. Defecate crystalline energy into the body hole to increase thermal expansion for abbreviated charge times. Uh, was there, man, was any of this stuff... No, none of this is stuff I actually wanted or cared about. I guess we'll see if it, uh... We'll see if any of it becomes useful. For now, I'm just gonna hold the points, I guess. Nope. Ooh. Check that out. Does that make you blue? I get it. Color puns. Oh, this isn't what I wanted at all. Here we go. So, I've been enjoying this game so far. I'm surprised at how um, discreet the areas are. But I guess we can probably just operate the moon, the, the zapper, the giant zap pad thing that we just used and head back to the old areas at any time. I just bet. Okay, helmet health. This is a good thing. I am still occasionally having problems where I uh, suddenly get blown up all at once. A little bit more max HP would help avoid that situation. Is 
So what is this way? Let's go this way first because it's less obvious. Which means it's more likely to have secret loot. Well done. Halt. You're in possession of an unregistered laser device. Just, just shoot him in the head. This is your first day? There you go. You do not have to be that dramatic about it. Flying oh. drones, huh? Speaking of watching out, check out this thing where I'm invincible. That seems to be fairly effective. No, no, no! Leave me alone. Oh, okay, hold on. Oh, ow, hey. Not cool, man. Come here, you. Okay. That actually took a lot of effort. So... If I get close enough to this thing, I can bank it off onto the other pads. I don't 100% know what I'm trying to do here. Yeah, what? What was the value of that? What is shooting at this do? I mean, it's just one of those. Uh, it's just one of those things that gives you energy, according to the map. Uh, the map symbol for it. I don't know why we would even care about this. You know what? I've decided I don't care about this. Back to the adventure. Ow. Um, which way do I want to go? I guess there's interest in both directions. Let's start with down. Because it looks like it doubles back into some areas that are behind a blue door. And this might be... If this takes us toward these rooms, I bet there's a way to get a blue body in here. Yeah, we're behind a blue door here. Man, the uh, the extra power ups come fast and furious in this game. All right. Ugh. Ow. It's fine. Everything's fine. Oh, having a remarkably hard time uh, engaging my neck in this stationary object. Alright. Well, my helmet's power is starting to become a lot more valuable as we uh, acquire cooler things to do with it. No entry. Does that make you blue? Alright, well, my, uh... Oops, that's not what I wanted. My theory that we would find a blue body behind the blue door turns out not to be viable at all. Well, there's gotta be one somewhere, man. Also, uh, some green Electrolux guys. Little, little Roombas. Or maybe just a dog with green clearance. Oh, hey. Uh, oops. Didn't really... Didn't really consider the implications of that, uh... Raised platform. I guess I could just go around, can't I? What is this? I teleported a ghost somewhere. Aha! Uh -huh. 
Why are these green doors so ill-tempered? Is that something I missed? Come here, you. Alright, easier to fight a blue body with a blue body. Ah. Alright, I do not have... Still, even after all this time, I do not have the greatest instincts for this game's combat. Alright, I guess the point of this room was... Just to get the body. Huh. Forget it. Okay. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, now we have a blue body we can... Oh, wait, how do I... How do I get this thing through here? What am I... I get this thing through here the same way I got it in here. Duh. Actually, wait a second. I want to try something. Nope, never mind. I thought maybe turning on my crazy invincible ray shielding would solve the problem. But apparently, it's not that ratio. Okay. <laughs> that was a little close. Nope. Nope. Don't care. This is my not caring face. Oh, wait a second. What is down here? Ah. Okay, Helmet Thrust is uh, one of the better upgrades, in my opinion. Happy to see that. We're a little bit more than halfway through all of the different upgrade paths, so we have to be uh, drawn up toward the end of the game here. Ooh, hey, look, free stuff. Oh, they have... Man. It's a real uh, real arms race going on here. As soon as I have some cool new tech, it seems like they also have cool new tech. I mean, I guess they have access to all of the same areas I do. Maybe they're just collecting all the energy and using it in their own upgrade system. How do I... How do I take advantage of this? Okay. He doesn't have a great shot. I'm assuming he's just... Yeah, straight and vulnerable. Makes sense. Um... Oh, his ray shielding failed eventually. So what is the... What is my intended... I have to hit all of these things, right? That's, that's the goal. Oh. Doesn't actually have to be in one shot. Just has to be within a relatively yeah, short period of time. Ooh. What is this? Wheels, sweet antenna, kind of trinky bird-shaped head. Y'all have to knock out that shield before y'all can get to the head. Try shooting it in the keister a bunch of times. Why in the... Ah! Wow. That is some powerful weaponry. Yep, and as expected, very little value. Uh, I could try to redirect its own laser into it. It's a little more difficult than I would have thought. Come on. Give me your head. Cycle disengaged. 
Well, this is exciting. And very, very strange. It does feel like we're moving up in the world, though, doesn't it? We used to mostly be restricted to two legs. Come on. There we go. Yeah, this this thing's pretty okay. Right, that's not of terrible value to me. I have to be very careful, apparently, for some reason. This whole room is covered in, in deadly lasers. So this moon facility does seem to have, um, kind of strangely, the same general shape as the last place that we were. I guess maybe it's not that strange. Presumably the same person built them both. Did we have access to a blue body from somewhere? Uh, how about right here? How about this blue body that's right here? Ow. That's stuck. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna bring him down here to open the door, and then I'm, I'm getting back in my crazy robot laser dog body. Because this thing is way you too cool to give up. Uh, yeah, probably. Aww. They're gonna force me to use a boring blue body instead of my cool... It's like a... It's like a laser dragon. Alright, everybody just calm down and stop fire. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Ooh, purple doors. Fancy. Yeah, we gotta be getting close to the end of the game because uh, we're getting to the end of the rainbow here. Violet security. There we go. It's actually a little bit, a little bit difficult for me to get the uh, get the good rebound shots. No. Yeah, a ton of them. Hmm. Gee, who could have predicted that the robot mastermind would have no use for your stupid bodies? Right, need to recharge my power. Fortunately, they're not aiming, they're just shooting in the same place all the time. Ow. Ah. <sighs> All this for a little bit of extra energy that I don't even want. It's just, you know, years of, uh, years and years of playing video games. It's giving me a real compulsion. See the extra thing, I just, I need it. Sometimes to a degree that's completely ridiculous. Okay, there. Is that all of it? Huh. I mean, I guess it was quite a bit. I just thought that the, uh, the animation was going to be a little more grand. That's all. Alright, it's fine. Anyway. The bodies are missing. Let's go find out what happened to them. Seriously, though, if you guys just want to run your ideas by me, I'd be happy to, uh point out when you're being really, really dumb. Ooh. 
All right, we'll do it that way. Ah. Uh, okay, wait, let's just chill here for a second. Regen some health. Maybe check this room that's probably a little more innocuous. Oh, or just use it for repair. Also, the uh, the map says that there is a thing over here, but I don't see one. That didn't work. That didn't help. Huh. I don't see this. I'm gonna try ramming it one more time. Nope. Ramming it with the power on. Nope. I mean, this is all like busted up pretty obviously. Huh. Oh well. I'm not gonna lose any sleep over it. Right, let's try to actually get through this room this time. Ah, uh, well, okay. Uh, the body rolls kind of uncontrollably when you hit the ground. I'm not taking the blame for that. Let's uh, just take a moment here. Alright, slow and slow. Nope. Nope, gave up on slow and steady at the last possible moment. Paid a heavy price. You are on the wrong side of the cover. Oops. You know what? There is absolutely no reason for me to be engaging in this firefight, trying to shoot him from across the room. Why would I not just bail? And then, uh, I guess, I guess I need to use this. Why would I not? This looks like an output, though. Yeah, I guess I have to go down here as I had. Why would I not just bail and steal the body? Why would I? Why did I bother trying to fight them? Also, what the hell is a mini scan doing here? These robots get lost a lot. In a blue moon, you just might have the correct clearance. I hate all the doors. Okay. Look at the blue clearance on Mr. Fancy Pants. Right, this situation is solvable. There you go. Here. Ah, Jesus Christ. This is a little stressful. Ah! Murder! Oh. All unauthorized entities will be lazed on sight. Okay, fair enough. Oh, jeez. No more, no more. Okay. Whew. Violet body. Yep, I just flew directly into a platform. I'm trying really hard to get a hold of these heads. You do not want to... There we go. Ah, finally. You know, you guys are the only ones firing weapons, right? It cannot possibly be my fault. Whew, alright. Violet security. Finally have the best possible clearance. All right, this one's just hidden by the wall. And also, we know what to do here, actually. 
this time. We just have to hit a bunch of these things. Is there any way to make this... You know, it feels like there ought to be a little bit more strategy involved. But just sort of mashing the, uh... Mashing the fire button while spinning the reticle around seems to work. Ow. Ah, okay, I think I see what's going on here. I think this is a one way yeah we had to we had to pull this open from that side okay all right there we go this room a much more pleasant volume all right well we have a ton of energy but i honestly don't even really care about any of the upgrades that we have available at this point so I guess we're just going to keep holding it until we actually need it for something. Alright. Certainly that, uh... That could not have been... The actual purpose of this room. Hold on. I didn't see all the way into the corner. Okay. Just making sure that they weren't trying to... Be sneaky and hide a thing just out of view. The way they're doing here. Although, in this case, at least it's obviously on the map. I'm always a little nervous about those double-sided lasers now. Trying very hard not to change the uh, relative direction of the mouse pointer from the helmet. Ah! I wish that the arc... Is this... Yeah, it looks like it still counts as gathered. We're just gonna move on. I wish that the arc on the uh, shield was just a little bit larger. Okay. Man, you really have to pull to get those to come off. Alright, so now we need to get back to another place where there was a purple laser. Or a purple door, rather. Uh, I don't know that I agree. Rotting flesh is certainly an ugly color. I don't know that I would say blue. But, I mean, first of all, why would the door even know a thing like that? And secondly, why would it be using that... What is the value of it saying that, you know? How do you like it? I don't actually need to be over here. I don't know what I'm doing. Where exactly am I going? It's like a pretty long way. Yeah, all the way over to here. Actually, how do I even... There doesn't seem to be anything connecting this area to the rest of the ship. Uh, there was a teleport pad somewhere that I was trying to get to, and now I can't remember where. So what's this? Let's go check that out. I don't know what I'm doing. Listen. It's not like I'm any kind of professional. Alright, we're gonna go check out that mysterious hole in the floor of the map. I'm sure it's just uh, some more helmet health or something, but it would be irresponsible not to go investigate. I do not remember which way I'm going. Uh, it looks like it doesn't matter. Also, this is where we're supposed to be going, clearly, so it's actually good that I turned around. Well, look who made it to the top. 
Okay, here we go. Oh, I see. No, no, no. Don't go through the door. The bodies are so eager to get through doors. Oh, it's that. I see, I see. I think. I hear you. I think that all those all those pads at the other side of the room have to be shot within uh you know, shot within a short period of time, and then it'll turn off the light. Bulb. Oh, yeah. So let's see what we can do. Is a highly secure area. Wait, oh no, I need the body. I need the body to open the door. That last attempt really blew. Uh, I need a blue body or I can't actually get out of this room. Is there a blue body somewhere? There must be, right? Yeah, because otherwise you could get stuck. Whatever, I'll figure that out later. I'm sure it's nothing. I'm sure it's nothing important. Is what I mean to say. Hey, look, I remembered that thing I was saying earlier. About how I seriously do not need to care about any particular body. Come here, give me this. Okay. Alright. Now, where am I going? I'm going to the top of this room. Oh, this is going to involve a lot of zip pads. Zap pads? Whatever. Pads. A lot of arrows and pads. I'm taking a lot of damage very quickly. Just run on through. You look busy. Alright. I'm going to Perhaps there's a vaccine. head back. Ah, my body. I forgot to stop moving before hitting the button. It's fine. We'll go back for it. Hi, orange guy. <clears throat> oh, orange try guy. Strategy. This is going to put me up to, like, 11. Yeah. Still have absolutely no use for any of it. Now I have to go get my purple body back. Or, I guess, any purple body that I see. Damn it. Those, uh, those floating mines pack a bit of a punch. Also, man, it takes so much pulling to get a purple body's head to come off. All right, there we go. Yeah, where does all this stuff go? This uh, this place is fairly expansive. Blue is the color of power. Ow! If your body gets within a certain distance of the door, you walk through uh, without any input. So what happened there is that guy punched me, my body got close enough to the door, and it was just like, nah, screw all this. Screw this noise. Alright, well, I think that, uh... I think that we're coming up on some plot points here, probably, in the very near future. 
And I don't really want to see any more plot in this video. Uh, this looks like this is another one of those things we have to open from the other side. So I'm looking for a... Uh... Oh, actually, we may be upon some plot already. Let's just see... Oh, no, never mind. This is a place we've totally already been. Alright, map man, come here. Okay, well that makes me feel kind of bad. I'm really appreciating... There's been a lot of stuff coming out lately with this sort of broken down aliens era sci-fi appearance. Is a highly secure area. And I'm really appreciating that. I, I find a lot of this stuff to be very, uh, very attractive. It looks really nice. Anyway, we're going to call it here for the episode. We've explored most of the Crazy Moon base. It looks like we've got the maps necessary for the rest of it. I imagine that this area is going to... Oh, we found Athena 7. Interesting. I imagine this area is going to be leading us to the, uh, to the bodies, or at least to the plot point about how the bodies were never here in the first place, and this is all an elaborate double-cross. Uh, sorry if that's a spoiler. I don't actually know that, but I feel like that's where we're going, right? It turns out Hank was, uh, was against us all along, and this is all some big manipulation job, and he's actually Methuselah, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, come back next time to see if I'm right. I bet I am. And we'll see you then.